Being a black person in technology has proven to be good, but also challenging. Because what I found is a lot of people did see VPs in a certain way. They were white men. And I didn't have an issue with that as long as there was a room for me. So when I was starting to climb up, what I did is I wanted to see what those got, what, what made them good. So I tried to have relationships with them when I could learn from them, as well as bring in what I had and what I learned in my days in radio to technology. So bringing my gifts, what made me, my strengths, what made me good to technology. And I found out though, you can't just sit in one space as a black person, you have to go to different departments. You need to let other people know that you're good and talented. Your hiring practices have to be strong so people can see the, the team you're putting up under you, as well as your leadership skill. So I wanted to brand that throughout solo wins in different organ different divisions so people would know me as that guy who, wow, he hires great. Wow, he always has success hitting his number. Wow, his um his his leadership skill is X, Y, or Z. And and let people know what that looked like so they could see my skills and my talent versus my color. Now, I didn't run for my color either, which is very important. Who I am as a person, I mean, I got some, some, some Michael Jordans on right here because that's who I am. That's what I'm about. That's the way I navigate around life. So having that confidence to be who you are, people receive that a lot better. That one, the, the first thing I would tell people, being a black executive, be who you are, be yourself. Don't let anybody, don't change who you are to get up there and then you're uncomfortable in your own skin. There aren't that many black women in the technology space, let alone in the leadership tier of black technology. And oftentimes, even for me, I'm a frontline leader, I'm a manager of a sales team right now, but that's often where you see us stop and where we plateau. And so I think it's important for us to be recognized because as we continue to strive for those higher roles and those senior leader roles and those executive level roles, we can continue to pave the way for others who are going to be coming behind us and trying to achieve those roles as well. But it also gives visibility because when you join a company, it, if you have aspirations to progress in your career, you want to see people who have been able to not only achieve that, but to surpass that. So that way, you know, you also have a chance. 